What's shaking, guys? My name is Luke Dancy, and welcome back to all my friends out there hanging out here on the old YouTubes. We are going to give you the latest and greatest out there in the magic world. These are some of the best tricks you're going to see in a long time, my friends. Some really, really hot stuff tonight. Got a giveaway for you if you want to have a chance to win some free magic. All you need to do is like and comment on this. You got to do it on the post, though. The live chat may or may not count for that. So, yeah, get in there and... Good luck to all of you. Uh, the giveaway this week is for Sentimental. This is a beautiful beautiful piece of minimalism. Um, I gave the guys on Facebook a chance to win this or Blade. They chose Blade. So you guys are going to get Sentimental. So if you want to have a chance to win Magic two times during the week, you can watch us on Facebook first at 8 p.m. And then you can jump over here and watch after I do that one. So anyway, here we go. Free Magic coming up for you guys tonight. And also answer your questions. And this is your first preview right now for the magic release coming up on Friday called Memo Card. If you wanna see it, let me know. Here we go, check it out. So there you go. That is your pre preview, excuse me, for the release that's coming out on Friday. You'll see the full trailer right here on YouTube at 3 p.m. Eastern time. Uh, so if you want to have a chance to win magic, be here. Also to see new magic, be here. Click on the bell. That's the notification that hooks you up with everything and lets you know when we post new stuff, right? Okay, so that is coming up on Friday. That again is called... Dun, 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 dun. memo card there it is so yeah just gave you a preview here the full trailer will drop then for you guys okay so what do you think in the chat there what are you guys thinking about that when you liking it i think the visuals are pretty awesome but what do i know what what, what do i know <laughs> uh we got the magic buzz saying wild uh, jesse's saying hey that's cool Brett want to know, is this live stream? Yeah, we're live, buddy. We are 100% live. Doing this for you guys every single Tuesday night. So if you like what you see, come back. All right. Good stuff. So that is coming up there for you guys on Friday. I got more stuff to show you. Lots of new magic to show you. Again, if you have any questions, let me know. We're tight like that. I can help you out. And again, to win the magic, all you need to do is drop a like and comment on this video. Um, and I will pick someone at random to win cinnamon tool free magic free magic okay so here's what's coming up on thursday i'll be streaming live here on thursday too i will be live with this guy you probably know who this is the one and only mark spellman will be live with me on thursday afternoon 4 p.m eastern time that's 1 p.m pacific in vegas where i am in blazing hot scorching hot vegas he'll be live with me uh i'm gonna get inside the head of a minimalist one of the best in the world, mind you. He's going to be live with me, so if you want to check that out, we'll be live right here on YouTube and Facebook, answering your questions and just learning more about minimalism, which I'm sure a lot of you guys have questions about. It's a very popular type of magic that people like to do, but there's not a lot of people that do it well, and Mark Spellman is one of those people that does it very, very well, so stay tuned for that coming up on Thursday this week, okay? I'll be right here at 4 p.m. Eastern time with you guys for that, so that'll be cool, all right? Uh, let's see. Uh, this is very visual. What are your thoughts? Which one? Which one do you talk about? Which visual piece? The uh, the thing I just showed you there with the the paper that folds. So, is that the one? <laughs> um, I'm also going to show you something that you probably saw yesterday. This is called Dreambox. Uh, this is more minimalism. We're all on this minimalism kick today, I guess, huh? Uh, this is very straightforward and I wanted to show you this because a lot of people think trailers leave out steps or details this is exactly what you see which is what you get she's gonna put a little lanyard on a little lanyard thing on he's gonna have her choose between two places Hawaii and Paris free choice uh, then you can choose some music to listen to on the way there these are totally 100% free no equivocate no magicians choice here choose a drink you can choose either one of the drinks they pick one 
And then last but not least, you choose who you want to go on this trip with and you have a handful of celebrities and they genuinely pick any one that they like. And after all that stuff is done, you kind of piece the trip together, where you're going, what you listen to, what you're going to drink, who you're going to go with. And then, of course, at the very end, they're wearing this lanyard thingy and you reach inside and there is a voucher that has the prediction 100% matches what they said. There's Paris, where they want to go, music, ACDC, and then on the back, Will Smith. They want to go Will Smith. Uh, what you see is what you get. The system in play is in play. You don't have to go to your pocket. There's none of that fiddling around for stuff. Um, literally, what you need to do to perform this is what you're seeing in action. Uh, the system is very, very clever, very easy to use as well, uh, which is something I think is important to note. And this is great for close-up or for stand-up, like a parlor type of show. So if you're looking for some minimalism, it's not too tough, you know, to do, then I think you might enjoy Dreambox. Uh, if you have any other questions about it, uh, let me know. Uh, I was watching the instructional for that earlier today, just so I would be able to answer your questions about that one. Okay, so let me know if you have any other questions, okay? Uh, Jesse says Dreambox looks good. It's cool, man. It's cool. Yeah. Would not steer you wrong, my friend. I would not, not steer you wrong. All right. Uh, so we showed you that and that. Here's some playing cards. I saw some people on the chat before we did this in the countdown uh, talking about these guys. These are the brand new soundboards, Midnight Edition. That's what I was looking for. Midnight Edition. And they are limited to 2,500. Now, a few things I like about these. Obviously, the tuck looks awesome, but this is the part I really, really like. That's the side of the tuck. Bam. Retro. Going back to the old cassette tapes, the old cassette players. I'm sure a lot of you guys have no idea about those because you're too young to know, but that's okay. That's okay. Uh, so that is a look at the tuck. He, these are the backs of the cards here. A nice look there. And another nice thing about these, my friends, they are the crushed B stock. So if you really like the cherries, this is the same stock as cherries. Uh, and the design here looks pretty sick too, right? So look at the back. Of course, everyone wants to see the ace. There's the ace of spades for you. There you go. And the Kings, people want to know court cards. Are they um, custom, kind of, sort of, color scheme changed, artwork? No. So there you go. Uh, that is your look at the brand spanking new Soundboards Midnight Edition. So if you want to grab them, do it to it. Stock up from your favorite magic shop right about now. All right. Uh, let's see. Dreambox is the voucher giveaway at the end. I mean, technically you could, but you're not supplied with things that allow you to do that. So if you wanted to make your own, you probably could, but yes, technically they can keep it, but you would have to do a little extra work so that you could repeat it again and again and again. I'll just kinda, kinda say that. <laughs> How we doing, Mr. Diesel? Good to see you as always. Always good to see you, my friend. <laughs> not much for Mr. Diesel. Uh, Magic Buzz want to know, is it built to last? The Dream Box is built to last, if that's the one that you're talking about. Um, yes, it is. Uh, can the spectators reach inside to pull the prediction out? They cannot. That's the only thing about that. I'm totally honest with you, 100%. Um, they cannot reach in and pull out the prediction themselves. Now, they do feel something in there, but they can't be the one to take it out. That has to be you. It's, I'm sorry, but uh, it's not. it's not real magic. <laughs> Uh, there's a Leo Lizard, how we doing, dude? What's up, what's up? All right. Uh, we're gonna breeze along here. I got more stuff to show you. I'm gonna take a little break on my side and show you what's crazy this week. This is Ryan Bliss bringing you what's crazy this week. Okay, so this trick is all about strange images and locations. So we're gonna have a card picked. The, uh, ten of hearts we also have four queens in the card box this is the first image in the first location the queens in the box and the ten over here if I wanted to switch these cards I would just put the queens over here and I put the ten in the box right we don't even need the deck anymore we just use the queens and the queens uh, end uh, in my hand and if I wanted to uh, we would have these queens switch with the ten once again and it's done. They have switched back. The queens are over here. The ten is back in my hand. It's true. I can prove it. See over here in the box are those four queens. They're just smaller. And if the four queens have become smaller, it would make sense that the ten
become bigger. Images and locations. Ryan Bliss, killing it, my friend, killing it. Uh, so this is a very, very visual, obviously, uh, transposition type of thing. Now, you're not seeing the moment that they change, but the ending is very, very visual. Um, so this comes from Harapan Ong and his book, Principia. Uh, this is one of those tricks from the book that kind of flew under the radar a little bit, which is why I wanted to show you this too. Um, but the trick fooled me the first time I saw it, and I'm curious if it got you guys too. Um, so this is in Principia. Uh, which we just got a shipment of them in, I think, last week. So we've got a we've got a few in stock for Magic Shops. Um, so if you guys are interested in checking that out, uh, you can check out the book Principia. I think it's got like 60 tricks inside of it, and it does come with the cards to do uh, pretty much all the tricks. Not all of them, but a lot of them. Uh, so that is from Harapan Ong with a touch there from Ryan Bliss. And I wanted to bring that to you guys because it's just so weird and different and that's really what i like about Harapan's magic so yeah that is that and if you guys have any videos you want me to feature each week you can actually drop me an email uh at social at murphysmagic.com social like social media social at murphysmagic.com uh, if you have videos of yourself or other things you've seen if i feature it on the show you I'll hook you up with some free magic okay that's just how we roll around these parts all right so that is what's crazy this week All right, all right. We are just breezing right along. And don't forget, we are doing giveaways for Magic as well. Uh, all you need to do is drop a like and comment. You can, of course, drop a like uh, now, and you can comment now. But to officially be entered, you need to drop a comment in the post when it's actually up. I'm going to leave. Uh, you know, I'll leave everything going here for you guys. But uh, just like last week, the comments that go up after this are the ones that are going to count. So, yeah. Okay. Cool, so, and you have a chance to win what, Luke? This, Cinnamental, and I'll show you the trailer for that in just a second, too. All right, but up first, I've got another really cool thing I wanna show you. Um, you know, this is the week that usually people are in town here in Las Vegas for Magic Live. And this year, obviously, because of what's going on in the world, people are not coming to Magic Live. Magic Live is not happening, um, but it's still hot out here. So I thought, you know what? Let me find a piece of hot magic, and hook you guys up with that. So let me show you something that you might not have seen yet, but I'm always out looking for the good stuff for you boys. So check this out. This is called Hot Light. This uses a Sharpie, every magician's best friend, it seems, and some fire. So you're able to hold a Sharpie, put something on the end of it, and cause it to light on fire at your will. Total control over this. A uh, Very nice visual thing here. Uh, what magician doesn't like fire for all kind of little mini pyromaniacs. Um, so you can see here, this uh, is under your control. This is the light version. And you can see the cord comes there. This is rechargeable, USB chargeable there. Um, another really cool thing about this is the Sharpie writes. A lot of people think, oh, well, gimmick Sharpie, you can't write with it, but you can, which is pretty cool. So you can actually write with this too. Um, and... This is the cheaper version of the original because there's no remote. The original version of this had a remote to it, so the price obviously is gonna be a little bit higher. This one comes in at $60, six zero, and you just control it by hand. Uh, so there you go, if you like fire stuff, and I know you do, light up your magic, that is called Hot Light, and it again is $60, uh, and that one comes from Zam Wong and Bond Lee. Not James Bond, but Bond Lee. Okay, so there you go. That looks like something you want to grab. Hit up your favorite magic shop and they will take good care of you. Okay, as Trip says, that trick is loot. I see what you did there. <laughs> I see what you did there, Trip. I understand. Uh, Reese Magic is saying, wait, who won the GT Speed Reader deck from last week? I did go into the comments and tag, uh, not tag, but I, uh, I responded to the person that won. I will go in real quick and look. Uh, let me make sure I got my volume off here. But I definitely went in last week and did announce the winner. Uh, so the person I picked last week that won the GT Speed Reader was, and again, you need to be in the regular comments, guys. That's where I choose the winner. Um, the person that I picked was, 
me see here. I want to here it is. Uh, Lilum Frost, Lilum Frost from Plano, Texas. So Lilum Frost. Going forward, I will also announce the winners at the top of the post in the comments. Um, but it was Lilum Frost, and I did go in and announce that for them. So there you go. All right. Uh, can't believe it right. Say, hey, man, you know, a lot of magic props don't. They don't do what they're supposed to do sometimes, funny enough. So I was happily surprised that it actually wrote. Uh, how do you make sure your hand doesn't get burned by fire? Uh, well, you're holding the marker, bud. Uh, you're holding it down here. And the fire happens up here. So your your hand is back here and the fire is up there. So you're, you're okay. It's also like flash products, so they're going to burn right up. Um, but also make sure you are of age to buy flammable products. That goes without being said. Okay. Uh, how do you get to the comments? Yeah, see, that's the thing, Trip. I do these live. So in order to enter, you have to do the thing after the live because you, your comments don't go into the comments for this post under the description. You know, if you guys have a better way to do this, I am all ears, but I can't see a list of people that have liked this post. So it's kind of hard for me to see who exactly is interacting with the post. And when I edit out the intro for this video, the live comments go away too. The live chat goes away too. So you, you have to comment in the main section after the video. As Reese Magic says, after the stream, I don't have the regular comments. Yeah, so. Uh, Enrique says, does Principia come with those cards? It does. It, the cards you saw in the video, I showed you it does. It comes with some other cards as well for other tricks. There's 60 tricks in the book, so it doesn't come with all 60. Um, but the trick that you did see uh, earlier from Ryan Bliss does come, those do come in there. Okay. So good question, Enrique. All right. So I showed you that one too. Let me check my list real quick. Uh, showed you memo card. That's what's popping up on Friday. Showed you the preview. Showed you Dreambox. We talked about it. You guys didn't really have any questions. I showed you the new playing cards, soundboards, midnight. I told you about Mark Spellman popping up with me on Thursday. That's going to be a lot of fun. So again, if you guys like minimalism, uh, the dude is legit. I told you all about Hot Light. We just showed you that one too. So that is cool. All right. And Cinnamental is the trick that you guys do have a chance to win. Here's the artwork once, once more. So if you want to have a chance to win Cinnamental, again, a like and comment on this. And I'm going to run the trailer for you. If you don't know what Cinnamental is, this dropped a few months ago, but now you're going to have a chance to win one right here. And I will announce the winner sometime before the weekend, over the next couple of days or so, okay? So keep an eye out for that. Um, but here is the look at Cinnamental. This is what you guys have a chance to win. knew where you would start. They wrote something down. Let me see. <laughs> Check it out, look. <laughs> oh, nice. That's right. Hey, it is, was, was that the thing? Yeah, it went absolutely insane last night. You're not going to believe it. It was great. Okay, so tell me. I get to the bar and I start walking in slow motion. Dude. And then in the corner. Really? Slow motion? Again? I thought we weren't doing that anymore. Oh, yeah. So I get to the bar, I'm feeling crazy stupid fine. I scout the area and I go up to these two chicks. I had one of them think of a movie, shuffle the cards, and without ever looking at the faces. Wait, 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 cards? Movies? Yeah, yeah. Dude, start at the beginning. Oh, you wanna know from the beginning? Yeah, that's what yeah. I'm saying. Oh, thank you so much. Okay, so. Everything started with this guy, and he was like, I'm Nicholas Morassis, and I will be creating the best mentalism effect in the multiverse. And he was like, but first, I need the best designer ever. So Nicholas found this other guy, and he was all like, I'm Phil Smith. The first rule about designing is you don't talk about Dude. designing. <laughs> Dude, what are you talking about, man? I just want to know about the performance. Oh, okay, okay. All right, well, maybe you've seen some of these. So Fight Club, Memento, Whiplash, Vertigo, you know, there's just a bunch of different movies, okay? So what I want you to do is you're going to be thinking of a card. You're going to cut anywhere you want and hold it up against you so nobody can see. Yes? Okay, there should be some cards left over here. Hand them over to her. All right, now look at the card that you cut to. Okay, and now shuffle the cards. So here's what I'm going to try to do. I'm going to basically just go through the cards like this. So just think the word stop. Okay? All right. 
did you think? Did you think stop? Oh, I didn't hear you. All right, let's try something else. Let, let's try something different, okay? Let's try... Um, have you seen this movie? No. You've never seen it? Okay, but you remember the name? Yeah, I remember the name. Okay, keep repeating it over and over in your head. Okay, I know, cuckoo. So it has to be one flew over the cuckoo's nest, right? <laughs> And the second face, I have never seen anything like this. It's so unique and incredible. Let's try this. Look at me for a second. Uh, I think I know, I think I know. And start dealing face up quickly. Yeah, now, yeah. And then, and then something's gonna tell you, so you're gonna wanna stop somewhere. Yeah, yeah, go ahead, feel free. Something may, is this where you wanna stop? No, okay, keep going. <laughs> right here. Yeah. Something, something made you stop in this location, right? You could have stopped here, you could have stopped here, you could have technically stopped there or there or on any of these, but something made you stop here. Take a look at the card. What does it say? W which one is it? Your window. Have you seen this movie? No. No? That's interesting. Let me see. So then what happened? Then what happened? Okay, so basically. <laughs> Check it out, look. I got it right. Every single time. It has to be one flew over the cuckoo's nest, right? <laughs> Is it Forrest Gump? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Rosemary Baby. There you go. <laughs> That's crazy. Wow. Cool, man. Like, I'm like, literally like. Looking at it. Yeah, man, it's incredible. There's no fishing, there's no progressive anagram, there's no controlling of any cards, there are no markings. It's so simple to do. And the best part is that once you see how clever the method is, you're just gonna smile to yourself. I'm telling you, it's so good. So what's the method? Okay, so it's super simple. All you gotta do, oh, I'll take a sentimental, please. Uh, I, actually, I'm gonna have one too, but uh, hold the cheesy trail. You know, you know, I'm a little. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Yeah. Oh, have I told you about the time I wrote that cat? There you go, my friends. Kick-ass job from our studio team. Did the trailer, made it look good. They made it look real good. And that is what's up for grabs this week. So if you want to have a chance to win Sentimental, do it to it. All you need to do is drop a like, hit the old thumbs up button over there. I'll see you guys. I'll see a few of you in the corner that haven't done it yet. You know what? Shame on you. Shame, shame, shame. I see you. I see you. Um, and all you need to do is drop a like and comment. After this video goes up in the comment section, drop a comment. Tell me what your favorite thing was from this week. Tell me where you're from. Give me some feedback. Just get social in the comments and you will win a free copy of Sentimental if you're chosen at random. And I'll announce the winner over the next couple of days. Okay? So that is what's good this week. Uh, I'm going to show you one more time what's coming up on Friday. This is what your preview is this week. Let me take that down. This is called Nemo Card. And there you go, my friends. Uh, that is dropping on Friday. You'll see it right here on the old YouTubes at 3 p.m. Eastern time. So check out the full trailer then. That's all I got for you now. I give you the preview every Tuesday right here. If you like the look of that one, you'll be able to pick it up on Friday. Memo card. All right. That'll do us for tonight. I hope you guys enjoyed our live hangout, our little chat, showing you some of the best new tricks around. If you like what you see, show me some love out there, either in the comments or you know what to do over here on the old YouTubes. Uh, how much does Memo sell for? So the one I just showed you, uh, this guy, uh, that's popping up on Friday, so I think it's 25, 25 bucks. So what you're seeing there uh, will cost you $25 uh, from your favorite magic shop. And just so you guys know, we do have a lot of questions sometimes about why you can't buy from our website. Real quick heads up that Murphy's Magic is a wholesaler distributor of magic. So we sell to the magic shops. They're our customers. 
Um, so if you buy magic that you see from us, you can buy it from your actual magic shops. That's what I'm getting at, okay? So there you go. Um, uh, da, 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 da. Oh yeah, and Jesse's got it right. If you see this comment, that means you're still watching. If you're still watching, then you should like the video. Just saying. Jesse just dropped the mic. He just dropped the mic for us. Appreciate you, buddy. <laughs> and you're right. <laughs> All right. Any last questions for me, though, before I run? I am going to get out of here now. Uh, let me look through the, the chat, make sure I didn't miss anything here. Uh, appreciate you, my friend. You punched it. Oh, you punched the like. Bam, bam. Punched it. Uh, let's see. Uh, no, 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 no. I don't see any other questions. don't see anything else. And as always, if you guys have any feedback for stuff like this, let me know. I'm always looking to make what we do better and better as we go forward. And I would love to see some of you guys this Thursday with Mart Spellman. I'll be here live Thursday, 4 p.m. Eastern, hopefully with you. Uh, you need to make origami. For the, the trick you just saw, you do, but there's other versions on the thing. That What you see with the folding of the paper is just one thing you can do, and you'll see that on the trailer. There's a lot of other very visual things you could do with the principle that do not involve origami. So just so that you know, okay? Uh, where will the winner be announced? I'll announce it on the in the comment section of this video, this video later this week. I'll announce it at the top. I'll pin it, and I'll also go into the comments, and I will announce to the person in their comment that they have won as well, and tell them what to do to get their free copy. Okay, there you go. All right, that's that from me, my friends. Stay safe out there. Uh, take care of yourself and each other. Stay cool. I know I'm out here in Vegas, and it is hot, hot, hot. What are we looking at right now? I am looking at dun, 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 106, and it is 6 o'clock at night. It's freaking hot. It is way too hot. <laughs> All right. So I'll catch you guys next time. If you haven't yet, hit the bell so you know when we pop up again next time. All right. I will see you guys all later. My name is Luke Dancy, and I am out of here. See ya.